Welcome to an introduction to discipline-specific databases. In this tutorial, we will talk about the definition of a database, discuss how they are used in research, and demonstrate how to find, access, and use databases available through the Community College of Aurora Library. Let's get started! A database is commonly defined as a structured set of data that is searchable in multiple ways. You can think of a database as a giant folder filled with information in the form of articles, books, videos, images, and other source types. Libraries subscribe to a range of databases and provide users with free access to the resources they contain. With so many databases to choose from, it can be difficult to know which one to use for your own search. Many databases contain information related to a specific topic, subject, or discipline. For example, if you need peer-reviewed articles to use in a paper for your history class, you can use a history database to narrow down your results and gather relevant resources. There are two ways to find discipline-specific databases in the CCA Library. On the library website, click on Find Articles to navigate to the list of available databases. You can browse databases by clicking on Databases by Subject and looking through subjects in the drop-down menu. Select the subject you are looking for and click on the title of the database that looks like it will be most helpful to you. If you are using databases from off-campus, you will need to enter your S number to access the database home page. Another way to find subject-specific databases is through D2L. On your course home page, Find the research box, which contains links to library resources. Click on the down arrow in the Recommended Databases box to see a list of librarian-suggested databases for that course. Select the database and click Go to be directed to the database home page. While many databases look the same and have familiar tools, some are trickier than others to navigate. The best way to get better at using databases is to practice using them for yourself. Research can be difficult, so remember to reach out to a librarian through chat, email, or phone if you have any questions.